All right, let's get your Thursday morning started off right here. Checking in on first alert Doppler after a bit of a bumpy afternoon and evening yesterday. Those storms and thunder showers popped up after 1 p.m. as we expected. Most of them behaved, but a couple got a little out of hand with some reports of some wind damage down towards Deschler. And what you just saw what Stephen was reporting about 10 minutes ago up there towards Sylvania. Some trees on power lines that are still being cleaned up right now. Just a few sprinkles, one south towards Fostoria, another one right over Clyde and Green Springs area. Otherwise, we are relatively quiet for now. A cold front that's slicing right through the Great Lakes. It's got showers and thunderstorms extending from the north part of Michigan back towards Fort Wayne and into Illinois. This is the front we've been watching all week long. It's going to shove our muggy air out of here and at least give us a maybe 24 to 48 hour break with some less humid air. But that's about all we get because the humidity will be returning. Now, to get to that less humid area, got to go through the potential for some more downpours for today. Let's tune to our hour by hour forecast to see exactly what that looks like. Southerly wind right now, so we're still in what we call the warm sector of this system. Very warm, very muggy. At times can be unsettled, and that's what we expect for this afternoon. The atmosphere to bubble up once again and create some of these scattered showers and downpours. Here's the timing at 1 p.m. Notice by three, four, five o'clock, these showers are racing out of the region. But if you've got family up towards the island, Cedar Point, it'll be hanging on a little bit later on the afternoon there. Everybody, though, skates on by by this evening. It's still a possibility you could get a downpour for tonight. But by and large, the wind is going to shift to the northwest and we'll be feeling at least the start of some less humid air. You'll really notice it by the time we wake up for tomorrow morning. Maybe a little bit overcast, but it's going to be much less muggy. Highs are going to be in the 70s for tomorrow. I promise it'll feel a whole lot different. Free air conditioning will be back in the forecast for your Friday. As far as today goes, still at chance for a few thunder showers this afternoon. It is muggy. Highs in the lower 80s. Turning less humid tonight. Rain ending at 60 degrees and then a high only in the 70s for tomorrow. Quick glance at our extended forecast still gives us a chance for some weekend showers. I'm highlighting Sunday for the higher chance for downpours at this point and chances for rain do extend into early next week where highs go back into the 80s. That's the latest on our first alert forecast this morning.